green technology is a technology that used to conserve the natural resources by limiting the negative impacts that cause to produce the products and facilities. In this video, we are emphasizing on production of electrical energy by adapting an idea from the vortex which is the bladeless turbine. Electrical energy are produced through the bladeless turbine through the vibration caused by the wind. So basically, how does the bladeless turbine work? Firstly, when the wind strikes or passes the mass of the bladeless turbine, it will create vortex or also known as the spinning motion of air. The vortex then exert forces with certain frequency on the mass. When the frequency of the forces equals to the natural frequency of the mass, resonance will occur and eventually the mass will vibrate and oscillate. This phenomenon is known as vortex induced vibration. The vibration of the mass will create kinetic energy and this energy will be transformed into electrical energy in the generator. The structure of the bladeless wind turbine is structured cylindrically without any rotating blade which differs from the conventional wind turbine. The outer cylinder is designed specifically to be rigid which has the ability to vibrate upon the action of wind towards it. From the diagram, we are able to see that this is the mast followed by the generator which is at rock bottom and also the anchor which is supported by the generator. As for our material of the turbine, we suggested to use carbon fiber reinforced polymer. This is because of its properties where it is solely resistant to corrosion and it has a long-lasting durability. Furthermore, carbon reinforced polymer tend to have higher tensile strength which contributes to rigidity. It can also prevent the turbine from tearing apart due to its sharing force of the wind and to support vibration motion. Well, what is the advantages of using bladeless turbines? First and foremost, bladeless turbines can save a lot of place. This is because conventional turbines consist of large blades and it requires larger separation distance from one another. Not only that, but the oscillation of the bladeless wind turbine is very tiny and less aggressive compared to the conventional wind turbine. Thus, this prevents the wildlife such as birds and bats from being killed. The last advantage of this amazing wind turbine would be that it does not require a complex manufacturing process but only requires a simple design and thus we can save costs and we can save money. Thank you.